Alright, welcome back. Um, we'll just call it the same thing. Actually, no. This is your name? Yep, that's okay. I typically make this the evil counterpart in games. Uh, what the hell? Chris? Is that you? God damn it, Chris, where the hell are we? Whatever. Let's just try to find a way out of here. Howdy, I'm Flowey, Flowey the Flower. Hmm, you're new to the underground, aren't you? Uh, golly, you must be so confused. I'm gonna teach you how things work around here. I just wanna teach you how to mind your damn business. Hey, that's no way to talk to a kind-hearted stranger. So what, leave us alone and get out of the way. But, don't you wanna know about your soul? About love? Dude, why do you wanna show us this stuff so badly? Do you want our souls or something? How'd you... I didn't know. You're the one who said it. Chris, let's teach this idiot a lesson. What? what the hell are you doing? We're in a battle. How do you not know this? No one's gonna know what you're doing if you fight like this. Fine. It'll get you to shut up and hurry up and show us how you do it. Don't worry, this won't take long at all. See that heart? That is your soul, the very culmination of your being. Your soul starts off weak, but can... Why the hell am I on your side? Because you're a monster. A human has to fight the monsters, so... How the hell am I gonna fight with you? Now get out of here. Heh, <laughs> we showed that flower who's boss. Though, it kinda, it's kinda weird how he tried to trick us and steal our souls. Whatever the hell that means. Also, I thought magic only worked in the dark world. Hello? Is everything okay in... Isn't that your mom? What the hell is she doing here? I... Please excuse me. Hey, wait a sec. What the hell was that about? You'd think she'd be happier to see us. We should probably try to catch up with her, huh? Wait, don't you want to see... Why the hell is she running away? Chris, look, a training dummy. We should go beat it up. Uh, I think obliteration, you just grind enemies, right? You want your two XP and one gold. Huh. It just turned into dust. It's kind of eerie, not gonna lie. Um, hey, Miss uh, Dreamer? We're kind of wondering, uh, why you're running away from us. My apologies. I could not bear these emotions, and I did not want to worry you two. But of course, I failed at that. Oh, uh, um, sorry. Please do not apologize. You did nothing wrong. But I... I must ask you. My child, who had been taken from us far too early. My child, who in spite of your light-hearted pranks, was a delight to our people down here, and inspired hope into the lives of many. My child, is it truly you? What? Taken? Ma'am, I'm pretty sure Chris is too busy to get themselves killed. Chris? Uh, yeah, your kid is Chris, right? Uh, of course. I apologize for my emotional outburst. Even if they survived, they would not have sur even lived this long. It was unreasonable for me to think thought that Chris was them. It's whatever. So you say that I am the mother of this child? Uh, yeah. And you know my last name as well. Yes, you taught little kids at school. Really? Well, unfortunately, I am not the same Toriel. Huh? 
I am not a teacher, nor am I a caretaker of Chris. Rather, I am the caretaker of the ruins, a formal and a formerly a fairly regarded royal figure. So how could this... No, that... Huh? Could it be that you two are from another world? I guess that explains what's going on. You know how we get out of here? Possibly. You could perhaps meet with the underground's royal scientist. He's always doing interesting exper experiments. He may be able to help you travel home. How do we find this guy? You will have to travel all the way to Hotland. It is pretty far away, but I'm sure that you can, do you can make it. After all, you both are traveling together, are you not? Hell yeah, we are. Excellent. I will prepare something for you to take on your travels. You should not take very long to reach the end of the ruins. Good luck, you two. Uh, thanks. Oh, Chris. You two could possibly use my help on your way. I will give you a cell phone. You already have one? Of course. And I will give you my phone number. If you, need, if you have a need for anything, just call. I hope to see you two very soon. So, we gotta meet with this royal scientist guy to get home? Hmm. This should be pretty fun. Let's get going, Chris. all of that. Might need it. I don't really remember if there's any hard battles in here. Pop, pop. We're XP and we're gold. Ribbit Ribbit. Five gold that time, that's good. Ah, oh, I didn't win there. Oh, okay. So I think that means this area is good, right? Yeah, okay. So there's cracks in the ground will make us fall. Uh, got it. Right, yeah, we have to leave the room every time. Oh, this is going to take a while. I suppose you're already aware of my affinity for pie, yes? Well, I would like to know your flavor preferences. Chris, do you prefer cinnamon or butterscotch? We'll do cinnamon this time. Cinnamon? I see. And Susie, what would you prefer? Me? If she doesn't have, like, chalk or snails, then... I guess butterscotch. Ah, I see. Cinnamon or butterscotch. Thank you very much.
This is gonna take a while, I bet. Oh, you're still alive, okay. That mm, too early. Whoops. There we go. Oh, we're getting real strong already. We've already got a lot more health, which will make things a breeze. Chris, not that I mind or anything, but like, okay, I do mind. What the hell are we doing? Why are we like hunting down enemies? Is this place freaking you out or something? Honestly, I think you should just ignore them. They aren't a good use of time, you know. Uh, okay. <laughs> yeah, about that. Oh, this one's gonna take a minute. Because I have to leave and re-enter this room and go down to there. Get 16 more experience and we'll level up. Oh, Progit's running away now, okay. Alright. Uh, not gonna read through all this again. Oh, this one's gonna be interesting. Oh, these guys have a lot of health. Okay, um... That is... This will only get easier. One more. Oh, we're getting real powerful now. Oh my. That's a lot of damage. Or actually, no, we want to do this. this. Yeah, I don't think we can take them out in one turn, but we can do it in two. Which is pretty decent. Right. 
doing good damage, which is nice. Nunsus are filled with power. Whoa. Jeez, it's been here for quite a long time. Uh, okay. Nothing new. Uh, hello? Oh, it's you. Are you here to beat me up? Uh, Chris? Um, why don't you let me talk to them? Huh? Oh, okay. Uh, let me check. Chris, I don't think this enemy can get hurt. That's attack 10, defense 10. Enemy weakness, root. Oh, I'm real funny. Oh. Oh, no. What the? How did you... You used her to kill me? All just because I wanted to take a nap? Why? Chris? Why did you make me do that? They weren't even really doing anything. What? We're just gonna be back to our world after this. We really don't need to do this. Just try to cool it, alright? Better donuts? No. Not useful. This one on the other hand. I will grab a few of those. Hello? This is Toria. Apologies for not responding to your calls very much. I am currently busy preparing something for you and Susie. Thank you for your patience, dear. Wait, did we level up from that? Nice. Gonna take down Mike Wazowski. Please don't pick. Oh, okay. Yeah, about that. Alright. Now, I think I remember there being a decision just before Tutorial's house. I'm gonna say before that. I don't remember where the next save is, but I'm hoping it's not <laughs> at Toyo's house. Alright, let's gra grab some equipment. Yeah, I think that's like armor, Rasu so would probably see it. Yep. Okay. Same dialogue. That's it, okay. We gotta do that every single time we come in this room. Yeah, I think we need to defend with Chris. Yeah, okay, that optimizes it the most. I don't remember exactly where Toriel's house is in the ruins. I 
kind of just rush through it all the time, so I don't really pay attention. I know what the room before it is, though, so we should be fine. Only have to do it two times for both of these guys? Okay. That definitely saves some time. Let's move on. Okay, yeah, they're still dashing at me. Wanted to see. Is he running? I couldn't tell. Next time we get through here, I'll check. Also, we're already really high level. Or love, I guess. But... Yeah. I think what I'm gonna be calling this these episodes right now. Um this one right. No, they're not running yet. Okay. Yeah, that didn't take him out. Alright. It's okay, not even with two big hits, I can't take him out. Wow, okay. Gold, let's go. Level five. Like, yeah, normally don't you get to level four? Did that absolute get that much experience? Yeah, okay, I think after this battle we go to the save station. My health is getting real low. Ow, okay. Wait. How many did I do in that room? Did I already do three? I thought I only did one. <laughs> Whatever, I mean, I'll take it. Oh. Interesting. So, love five. Are we gonna actually kill Toriel? I mean, I know it's called obliteration root, so I don't think it's quite genocide. But it might be, I don't remember. It's just been forever since I've seen anything about this game. I think looks is easier to kill. 
No, nope, not really. I have a feeling our love's not gonna increase again, is it? I might do some cuts, because it is going to be a very long game if I don't. Just cut between fights, maybe. You can hear the wind blowing amid the silence. You feel power in your hands. Okay, I know this is the room, but I'm going to go check over here. Oh! Rousey's not even there. It's a plastic toy knife. Pick it up. You're carrying... Oh. <laughs> Wait, was that unique dialogue? I, I didn't think there would be. So I kind of just skipped through it. But I think saw something about... Chris acting weird? I <laughs> wonder why that is. Hmm. Couldn't tell you. Alright, I don't remember if it's in Toriel's house or if it's outside. So I'm just gonna save before I even go to the room. <laughs> Love six. Oh, that... Okay. Well, we have a lot of health, which is really nice. How much How much at EXP? Uh, 99. Maybe Flowey? If we still fight him, he might actually avoid us. We'll see. I, 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 we probably still fight him. There's no way. He's just, like, Flowey's not the kind of person to avoid people whenever they're... Genocidal. Oh yeah, okay. If this magic truly did work, then I... Um, hi, Miss Dreamer. Oh, hello, Chris. Susie. Oh, Chris. You look miserable. What's wrong, dear? Huh? What do you mean by that? What are you talking about? Chris, now is not the time to be freaking out. Chris? What the hell are you muttering? I don't think... Oh. <laughs> fair, very fair. Okay, just normal game over text. I mean, that is the most fair response you could have had. Why don't you two follow me? You okay, Chris? You were shaking. Why don't you go to sleep with when we get when we go inside? It's a moss. Oh, we don't even care. That's how you know we're evil. Um.
Yeah, I don't think we're gonna... Yeah, we're not gonna actually steal anything. All the same dialogue. What? Are you jealous that I'm enjoying my bed? I'm gonna sleep in your own bed. Okay. Yep. All the same. I wonder. I. I don't know. I don't remember if this dialogue is going to be different. It might be. I mean, at most, maybe just take note of us killing everybody. You have been busy. Mercilessly gaining strength. How very interesting. You are aware of the, co the circumstances, are you not? Whether you continue down this or or show mercy, it does not matter. Either way, Chris, you are quite lost, aren't you? I have a proposition for you. You, Chris, Susan, come find me. Traverse the gray doors until you reach the golden corridor. Defeat the one that carries your own essence. Afterwards, I can cleanse you of your sin. I can set you free. Chris, I shall see you soon. Also, I didn't notice before, but their hands are just covered in blood, aren't they? Interesting. Chris, wake up. Chris, we've been sleeping for like two hours. You look kind of off, Chris. You're sweating. Here, why don't you take this pie? It'll taste a home. You don't have space for it? Then just eat it right now. Jeez. Oh, uh, whoops. Now let's get... Now let's... Okay, I'm... You know... Honestly, I'm gonna need that. Um... Oh, yeah. Let's open it back up. I'm 100% going to need that, so I'm just going to... Okay, move the mouse. Alright. Just gonna skip through this if possible. Might not be, but we'll find out. Oh wow, okay, you can. That was so quick. Oh my god. Okay, I've, usually in parts like that, you can't skip it. best item in the game, I'm pretty sure. Isn't it just a full heal? Yeah. Full heal. That, I think, can't really get better than that. So, let's save. Just in case Flowey's like extra hard or something. Or if you have to kill Tori. I don't know. I mean, I'm almost certain we're gonna kill Flowey. Might as well say it's guaranteed. Wait a moment. Huh? I forgot to warn you of the monsters that live here. What? 
can only assume that in your world, humans and monsters live in peace. That is not so in this world. For as monsters have been banished underground, for the tyrannous Asgore has sworn to take any human soul. If you change your minds on your journey, if we change our minds, then... Never mind. I wish you the best of luck. Be good, won't you, my child? Chris? That was really weird. Do you think she's about to ask us to stay? Well, we shouldn't let her down if she gave us up like that. Let's go home. Oh. Back up. I mean, we know what to do, so... Oh my, okay, yeah, he's not gonna win this one. That's for sure. Holy... I knew it. You're just like them, Tara. Okay, I don't remember how it's pronounced. I think it's actually it's probably Kara, isn't it? Yeesh, that's really damn brutal. Let's get out of here, Chris. The large flower it appears to be severely damaged. <laughs> None of my business. <laughs> Hey Chris, there's a person on the ground over there. Is it just me, or does that look like... What the hell is Noel 
doing here? Huh? Huh? Where am I? Susie, Tris, what on earth is happening? Hey, chill out for a sec. Uh, okay. Okay, so this sounds really weird, but we're in a different world. Huh? Wait, am I dreaming again? No. Everything is still real and boring. But if you really need to find some royal scientist guy, or some scientist guy to get home, we need to, like, we need to go to, like, some place called Hotland. It sounds weird, but that's what we need to do. You coming with or not? I'll come. Sweet. Let's go, Chris. Oh, she gets level two. Cool. She has ice shock. I wonder... Wait, guys, hold on. Holy shit, it's a really cool stick. Screw this pencil. Susie, you're really excited about that tree branch. I mean, you know, it isn't a pencil. Yeah, okay, Susie. Step forward and your head is gone. Oh, sorry, didn't mean to scare you. Great, it's this guy. Yeah, the woods are pretty dark. Speaking of dark, how are you doing? Are you the guy that runs the convenience store? I don't run a convenience store. Sans, Sans Skeleton. Are you that girl from back in town? What are you doing out here? What do you mean by that? Are you from our world or something? It tells me everything I need to know. How does that mean? Strange to say the least. Wait, you're not saying what I think you're saying. Uh, let's not think about that right now. You're trying to make your way home, right? Yeah, we're trying to find a scientist dude in Hotline. Scientist in Hotline. Any person that fits the script in this She might be able to help. How does he even call this thing? How do we get there? You're gonna have to go through the forest and go through the marsh until you reach a little point. That's where you'll be able to meet out. Sounds pretty easy. Not so fast, kid. You got my brother to deal with. To worry about. Is he dangerous? No. But he might try to capture that human. He's currently out setting up his puzzles. You might run into him on your way. So if you encounter him, just play along. Okay. Alright, see you up ahead. That was really stupid. Alphys is the royal scientist? Is there another me in this world? I guess. Does that also mean that there's also... Never mind. Let's go. Oh, yeah, right. Uh... You, Susie, and Noel are filled with power. Oh. Yeah, what the hell is that? A gray door. Who the hell put a door out here? It's... it open on its own. Maybe it's a prank? I wouldn't put it past that Sans guy. It's completely dark in here. Hello? Noel? I'm losing balance. Noel! 